The S-series cameras have a feature called eye dynamic range. So let me demonstrate how this works. So in this scene you're seeing here, the background is bright and dawn is dark. We want to correct that using eye dynamic. I'm going to push menu set. I'm going to go to the camera. I'm going to go to the image quality tab and I'm going to go to, the, to eye dynamic range, which is the default is off. So I can now go over here and you'll see the different settings. There's low standard, high and auto. Okay, I'm going to set it back to off here because I have customized one of the function buttons on the camera to give me quick access to eye dynamic range. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to clear this. I'm going to push that function button on the front of the camera here. Now I have, it brings up eye dynamic range without me having to go to the menu. Now every time I push that function button, it's going to walk me through the different settings and I can actually see their effect on the screen here. So I think I kind of like the way the high one looks, so I'm going to set that. And see, now you can see that Dawn is much brighter in this scene because what this is doing is lifting the exposure in the darker areas where Dawn is while maintaining the rest of the scene, so it's giving us a more even exposure. And that's how iDynamic range works on the Lumix S-Series cameras.